right back at you with another show. My name is Chris. Hey, once again, my name is Mark. And we are the ISO, ISO Swiss, Swiss show. show. And on today's episode, yes, we are back. Bye. Now, we got to apologize to all our fans out there, all our friends out there, because we had some logistical, technical wackiness going Wacky, on. Wackiness. But we are yeah. back now. We are ready to roll. Today, we got the number one high school player in the country. He's on our show. We got. I guess we call him we call him Big Booty. Big Booty Zion. We got Big Booty Zion. I ain't calling him Big Booty. We got uh we got <laughs> we got my man Trey Young. Po we, boy. Al we also gonna talk about all kinds of little after all star type stuff. We're gonna right. get into that. How about the shoes, Mark? Hey, for the shoes today, we're gonna go back to the skateboarding theme and we got a uh, Nike another in honor of the Travis Scott S B coming out, we got another mm -hmm. Nike S B dunk. Awesome. To talk about. So, hey, awesome. with that being said, brother, are you ready? Always ready, Mark. My man, man let's go. Uh, let's talk about. Our guy, your guy, one of the more popular guys in the entire NBA, Zion Williamson. Mm -hmm. He's the chosen a rookie, one. man. I mean, he, I mean, he came in. He's averaging what twenty two and yeah, seven. Twenty two and seven. Mark, yeah. straight up. Forget all the BS. Do you think this dude is a Hall of Famer? Oh, I think so. I think so, without a doubt. I know it's early. Mm -hmm. I know it's early, but. Given the, the amount of games he's played, which is only 11, 11 and games. he just came in and just exploded. Uh, right. And I, I think I think he's, he's Hall of Fame bound. What do you think? I think, I, I mean, mean. Got him. Okay, he played Milwaukee. Uh, Pelicans played Milwaukee a couple weeks ago. Yeah. And that's one of the better defensive teams. And Zion got busy on them dudes. Yeah. I mean, yeah. His second jump is second to none. It's so quick, it's man. It's so quick. It but is, to man. be that size, yeah, it's you know, freakish, it's man. just it's just like Sean Kemp and Charles Barkley put together. Right. Oh my and, god. What a, what a mishmash. Yeah. And it's just like, <laughs> wow. and, and then he's so humble and hungry, and yeah. you know, and then he's wearing George. He got like the whole package just <laughs> yeah, like right there. Yeah. And I just, you know, of course, you know, he went to Duke, so of course, oh, love, of course brotherhood. brotherhood. You know, brotherhood. Wanna, but what about the humbleness? Is that going to change? You think? Nah, I, mean, I, 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 mean, think I think that's something that's inbred. In. I think that's a parental thing. Yeah. Um, you know, maybe that South Carolina yeah, country. Yeah, that raising. You know, um, the way people love, you know, love country folks down right. there. And I just, I just Hi, think he's great. I just think he's really, really awesome. <laughs> I think so too. He's man. he's must see TV every time he's playing. He's hard. He's, it's hard not to not to tune into mm -hmm. and and just wait. You want him to be in the game. You want him right. to get the ball. I think he needs to shoot the ball more. He's averaging about about fourteen shots a game. Right. And uh, once you, you said you mentioned the fact about Brandon Ingram, his shots yeah. may go down. His right. shots may go down. Although Brandon Ingram's an all star, his shots right. may go down because. The um, Zion has the mismatch almost every yeah. every time down the court, yeah. you know. So it's like give him the ball and let's go to work around him. Right. Um, if he continues to 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 build upon this, build upon this, I would say in a year or two he's going to be completely unstoppable. Yeah. He's probably going to be one of the better guys in the NBA if he's not already. Yeah, he's, he's still honest. early. I mean, but I, I think like, yeah, I think with th with that being said, he is one of the premier players, and, and mm -hmm. to be that young man, it's just only going to get better, man. Oh, only no doubt, get better. no doubt. Yeah. So Zion Williams, ISO Swish. H-O-F. Po' Boys for life. Po' Boys. All right. Yeah, yeah. This is our segment we like to call Back to the Present. Back to the Present. Oh, I love it. I love it, man. This is a, a different one from us because we're mm -hmm. going to be doing a mashup today. You know, a multitude of players, you know, right. conglomerating into, you know, the ISO swishness of it all. Of it all. Of it all. Everything. So, hey, man, so today mm -hmm. we're going to put it in the time tunnel, all the little right. spinner who thing. We, who are we putting in there? We're going to put it in there. Uh, we're going we're to combine your man, my man, Allen Iverson. AI. With Russell Westbrook. What? Man. Hold I'm, up. Russell Westbrook <laughs> yeah. and AI are coming together. Yeah, I mean, just okay. just bring those two cats together and see what matches up in that. Let's see. Here we go, baby. Woo. Man. Oh, shit. What? Here we go. Oh. Here we go. Oh, ja oh. Morant. I ja. love it, Mark. Mark, Woo. this is the greatest mashup of all time. Oh, my goodness. You have two of the hardest. Oh, teams. man. These, I mean, Westbrook and AI I go like hard. They do. Okay, they do. no they joke. Did. And I think, I think the athleticism of Westbrook Coupled yeah. with the freaky quickness of Allen Iverson, right, and the fact that both of them just go hard, right, right. John Morant, John Morant, and you know, AI it. did that all his entire his entire career. Mm -hmm. He went hard. He had to because he was a small, was so small. dude out there, and everybody right. underestimated him at first, but mm -hmm. until he got you know 
to the league, basically. Uh, and Westbrook always goes hard, talks trash, I and backs it. it up. I love it. And, and I don't think John Moran has to talk the trash, but, like, he, but he does. He does, he oh, yeah. does carry I mean, a little a conversation I, out on the court. Give him two more years, and I yeah, think he'll be, the he'll trash talking talking a little schmickety smack. Yeah, the but trash is, talk is coming. Oh, you know it's coming, man. Right. But this is just a great, great you know, mashup. Man, these these dudes, right. man. This this John Morant is, is the new beginning, man. The right. new beginning. Right, right. right. Do mean, you think? Do you coming. think he should? Okay, put it this way: If Zion continues to kill, average twenty five and say eight. Yeah, yeah. Do you think that Zion should be Rookie of the Year or Ja? God, you know, just because of the sheer fact that ja, Ja's played more games than Zion, I think he should right. be Rookie of the Year. Although, you know, it's, it's, it, to me, I don't know if it's a popularity vote amongst you guys, um, but to me, I think it's a more popular vote. And, you know, Zion, of course, is, the, is the, more the face of the, of the NBA right now than Ja. Right, right, but right. With, um, on sheer time spent in the league, I think Ja should have the Man, player. forget that, man. I'm taking big <laughs> booty Zion, what? man. I'm taking big booty. I'm taking <laughs> you can't Zion go wrong, Williams but, as a man, rookie. If he averages 25 and 8, Come on, man. That's Come a, on, that's man. A, that's some heavy numbers, man. But job, yeah, man. That's that, crazy. But, and and there's a good chance that if he's averaging those kind of numbers, the Pelicans, Pelicans might move into the playoffs. Wow. Although I don't care about playoffs for, for rookie of the year. Who yeah. Because yeah. most rookies are going to come in and play for, for sorry teams anyway. That's true. But. Zion. Oh, man, I still think Ja, man. I still think Ja got it, man. That dude's got moves uh-huh. for your booty. You want to fight? No, nah, man. I'm a lover, not a fighter. Okay. So I'm just going to I'm gonna love the fact that Ja's going to be walking home with that Rookie of the Year trophy. Yes. Okay, let's talk about the number one uno. Numero uno. Numero uno Numero. player that's in my, the that's, country that's our right Spanish. now in high school. We should, we should, that's our SAP version of the show. <laughs> that's it? That's all you got? That's all I got. To Taco Bell. I know, I know Cuatro. <laughs> I know Kulo. I, I know. Was that a bad word? Kulo? Kulo? Coolio? Uh, not Coolio. Kulo. <laughs> oh, Kulo. Anyway, Jalen Green, baby. Jalen this Green. Guy, this guy is ridiculous. Yeah. Um, at, for a while, he was like number four or five in the country. I think he's been you know, playing extremely well. So they pushed him up to number one right. in the country um, on ESPN's Top 100. He's awesome. Yeah. And he's not signed. Uh, I'm talking to you, Coach K. <laughs> he's not signed right now. So I don't know what the deal is with that. Uh, I don't know if he's going to you know, maybe make a trip overseas for a year and then go pro, so. uh, go to the NBA. So. But he's kind of like a – He's kind of like a Devin Bookerish with with hops, and he wants to dunk on you. <laughs> right, but he can still shoot it, could handle it really, really well. Um, play hybrid that, player, yeah, yeah, played at a really good level for um, in in this past summer uh, AAU wise. So, uh, what you think about my man, Napa Valley dude, man? You know, a lot of dudes out of California. You know, you Sipping don't, that wine. yeah, man, just an easy sip on that Sauvignon Blanc. Uh, right. exactly. It's got good length for a shooting guard, mm-hmm. man, and um, he plays with long strides. Pause, right. but he's got to put some weight on, man. He's got to put some six fives, he's a little, one seventy ish. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but he's he's kind of an in between, like you said, like a Devin Booker type man. Can right. get up and down the court. Uh, he's effective in like either direction, offense or defense, right. man. And, um, right, 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 right. He can pull up on you real quick, man. Mm-hmm. So uh, I like his style. I like the way he runs. And I think he, if he goes overseas, I think he could be a number one lottery pick, man. Okay, yeah. Yeah. okay, so okay. Although I would man. love for. Uh, for the you know for the for the Dukies to get him or Maryland to get him or, 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 or North Carolina A&T, baby, go after this dude, man. Ain't Aggie Pride? That'll never happen. That's a, anyway. Sorry. <laughs> yes. Jalen Green, man, we like you, bro. Keep doing what you do. Right doing. on, Jalen. All uh, right, let's talk about one of the coldest cats, <laughs> Chili Frilly, Chili Chili Frio in the in the in the league right now. Uh-huh. Ice Tray. They should call him Free Freeze. What's that called? Freon. Free- Free on young, free, <laughs> free on young. That's why free. The His freedom dude nickname train. should yeah. be free on young. That's because it's that's because it's ice he's cold, ice cold, yeah, baby. Yeah, man. Trey, yeah. Trey Young, man. One of the, one of DeBarge's own. <laughs> <laughs> One of DeBarge's own lost singers, man. And this, let's talk about this cat. He's averaging, what, 30 and 9. 30 and 9. I mean, because he, he dropped 50 and the other day. This is his second year, right? This is his second year. Second year. Oh, and he's coming gosh. into his own, man. I yeah, mean, he, he, he put up 50 the other day. I was oh, like, man, what it's Miami. in the so, world? What, 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 I mean, your thoughts on him and a comparison to Steph Curry. What there ain't it? no comparison because he don't, he don't have no rings. <laughs> no That's early. Rings. See That's this early. right here? No. Give me some rings. No, I, th- I, think, I think they're very, very similar talent-wise. Right. Um, I think that he hasn't won anything. I yeah. mean, his team yeah. as of right now today is 17 and 41. <laughs> Shout out to my man Scott Lowry. Oh, man. Um, but 17 and 41 <laughs> don't get you into the playoffs. No. So, but, um, but And Steph has proven himself. He's two-time MVP. Yeah. And he's a three-time um, champion, so it doesn't really compare. Now, if you just took their skill levels right now, yeah. the way they shoot the ball from the logo, the way he his handles are super slick, yeah, 
They're yeah. very compared. The, the, the comparison is very similar, and they right. have similar body body sizes. Yeah, I think Trey's a little bit smaller, but um, they're both light skinned too, and they're both light skinned. Yeah, but um, the comparisons the comparison started early, especially with the, yeah. the long range bombing uh, and and the handle. I mean, I, I I saw him I saw him in college, and I didn't realize his handle was that good. Right. I mean, I knew he had that knew he had that incredible range, right. but he's got stuff. How can a little man? dude like that have that kind of range? I, I mean, that I just, don't get it. That takes some he's upper body for strength. Like, yeah, he's he's. he's He's skinny. He's bony Maloney. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't get it. He's shooting from like thirty feet. I mean, the the logo is has to be about thirty five feet at least on, on at, most on most on courts. professional court. Yeah, right. It has to be about thirty five feet. And he's shooting from that on a regular. Yeah. So I, I just don't get it. Um, he's he's completely fantastic. Yeah, fantastic. I mean, and they got similar traits. I mean, they both they play similar styles. They, of course, you know, the the, the Warriors are, are in a rebuilding mode. I mean, because right. of the injuries. Right. Um, but I think. But do you, what, hold on. Before I say that, uh, do you know that the Warriors have the number two pick next year? Wow. Really? They may get James Wiseman. Oh my goodness. In the middle, couple that with Draymond, Andrew Wiggins, Clay Thompson, Steph Dang. Curry, and Kevin Looney. And Kevin Loon. <laughs> wow. That might be some serious, uh, they, serious they issues. They might be back year. in the saddle in, in, in right. the West. Right, right, uh, right, right, right. Yeah, it's, wow, it's that's crazy. Interesting anyway, to see. I had to throw that little caveat. Yeah, yeah. But uh, so do you think he's better than uh, than Steph? You know, I think he's a he's a, a younger version of Steph right now. Just a young uh-huh. I won't say better. Right. Uh, because of the fact that Steph Steph is seasoned, man. That dude is yeah. seasoned. And um I think he's. I think he has Steph like potential, mm-hmm. and he can develop into something that if if he if he decide if he decides to get it together right. and lead a team into the championship right. and make that run, mm-hmm. he can be uh, considered Steph. Steph Steph-like. has way better hair. Yeah, <laughs> much better hair. Yeah, Steph, his, 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 his hair all over the place. Man. <laughs> like, I don't understand. At least what's he has some hair, hair, man. It's we, like, yeah, it's yeah, I'm, I'm like, hating whatever. on the hair anyway, man. But right, right. I wonder right, if he right, can right. sing too. You next said I mentioned the bars. Um, he probably can sing. Doubt it. Ooh yeah. Ooh yeah. Ooh no. <laughs> I can sing in the shower, man. I'm telling Trey you, man, Young. in the shower, boy, I'm a beast. Trey I'm Young, a Grammy you, winner. Can do what you're doing, man. <laughs> Final Trey Young, Ice Trey, baby. Right. All right, right back with another kick time where we talk about all the latest and greatest shoes that are rocking the world right now. Mark, let's go skateboard, man. Let's go skateboard. And you know, I used to skateboard. When I was young, I mean, I don't know a lot of you cats did skateboarding as well. I don't know, did you skateboard? You skate? Did you rode the, you rode the, rode the board? Didn't you? A little, little to pop some wheelies or something on the skateboard back in the day? Did you? My Come on, la- I'm not the my, only one who did that. My lack of conversation right now is proof. <laughs> that is proof that, that I you. have no skateboard wow. abilities whatsoever. Man. I never skateboarded. Never happened. Well, here's your chance to get it together and start riding high on the hog, buddy. Because today we got the Nike SB Dunk Low Pro. Infrared. Infrared. Yes. And okay. they have skateboarding shoes, Zoom Air Screw. They, they, they had a, uh, an Air Max 90 infrared, which is the exact same color. So this is a takeoff on that. And this came out uh, a little, it came out, uh, I guess, late December. I was able to get my hand on a pair uh, later for pretty much a little about $10 over retail. Okay. Sucks. But um, yeah, man, a great shoe. Mm-hmm. Um, the infrared color, of course, is infamous in the uh, Nike community, of course. Right. But it's kind of got a pinkish kind of a reddish yeah, it's color. Kind of pinkish reddish. But what, what say you, man? Would, would you rock these? Or yeah, what, man? man, these are slick. Yeah. I like these because they they're cool looking. I yeah. mean, I, I like the black, the gray, and I don't know if you guys can see this, but it has this this kind of like buffed uh, suede ish yeah, yeah. uh, kind of look to them. The black part is actually like regular cowhide leather, right? But then the other parts are. The suede, and then to couple that off with this really high intensity uh, infrared. <laughs> yeah, if you infrared, see it close, man, it's, it's 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 like it's, a it's it's like, like a neon I, I, I do I do like these. These are these are really cool. It's a great uh, summer shoe. But I don't. The, what I, only thing I don't like is like this, this front. I think it's going to get dirty real yeah. quick. This where you like you a cloth use, front. Yeah, you have to use some kind of uh, shoe cleaner or, or repellent to get to keep that from getting stained. Yeah. That's yeah. that's a must have with this. And issue. why all the SB Dunks have these puffy tongues? I, you know, I think with the with the with the skateboarders, you know, they're doing so many jumps and leaps right. and they're, they're coming down on that board and their foot foot uh-huh. goes forward when they hit that board oh so this, this is actually them, for protect them. F- to protect them yeah because i'm a skateboard okay. aficionado not yeah that's my guess but i think that's what the, the, the cushioning and okay that, so I, no i dig these i dig like, so okay. these are, what, what are these again these are the nike dunk low pro uh sb infrareds boom, boom. 
Thank you guys for watching this episode of ISO Swish. And we promise mm -hmm. that we are not going to go this long yeah. without another episode. We promise People that. People were jonesing for shows. Man, man it was, they were going crazy. It man, was just like, it was, it was like, that what's up with the ISO Swish show? What's yeah, going man. on, People, man? People were wanting some, you know, some more. So we're back. We, we're going to have a regularly scheduled programming. Okay, and so. I think most of it's my fault because you know I, I, I'm working. I'm starting. I'm starting a new route. And I was just kicking my behind, man. Mm -hmm. I was like coming home. I was like, I was like, Ugh, man, I'm tired. I'm tired. tired. Yeah, man. I went, I went out. I went a little soft on him. Yeah, well, pause. But you know, it's all. Now, but I'm back, rock. Yeah. Yep. Buddy. <laughs> anyway, so uh, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Hit us up on Instagram at the ISO Swiss Show. Mm -hmm. That is the ISO Swiss Show, and you can also hit us up. In the comments and let us know what you want us to talk about for the next episode. Right. Hey, that's how it right. works. That's how it works, buddy. Yep. So anyway, Mark, are you ready to roll, man? I'm ready to roll because we're leaving. <laughs> we're leaving. <laughs> we're, 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 where are we going? We gotta go. I, I have no idea where we're your going. Your name is Chris. And hey, my no, name is this Joe. Is, okay, <laughs> let me just tell you this. My name is Chris. Hey, uh, my name is Mark, and we're the ISO Switch Show, and, and we, we are out. out.